Good morning, everyone. So, I've just woken up. Well, about you know, twenty minutes ago. It's now seven thirty a.m. Friday morning. How could I possibly go to work today once she's and she's uploaded and not leave you guys with the video? <laughs> so, here I am, quite early. Excuse my morning voice. Um, to react to um, Alex, new favorite Amazon spring fashion find Bruno's birthday I can't believe she brings that candle so close to his face she's such an idiot favourite Amazon spring fashion find ok so it's more shopping she's already annoying me <laughs> she's already irritating I haven't even played the video oh, I mean I've played it like up until there just to fast forward the beginning of it um, you know her music and that bullshit but ok my friends <laughs> let's um Play and react to this second birthday bruniana it's your birthday today oh I fuck off you're so annoying bruniana bruniana what, what the fuck is that she's such a fucking idiot i'm so excited to celebrate bruno today um my mom and Cha Cha are coming over and we are gonna take the dogs to the beach it's a beautiful like 55 60 oh god her mouth Gee, and that's the only time Bruno gets to go out is on his birthday. Sure you don't want to lock him in the car while you're doing some shopping. Degree day, perfect day to go take the dogs for a walk on the beach. And Bruno, as you know, is obsessed with the ocean. He loves to gallivant through the waves. Just gallivant. Just like you love to gallivant when you're out going shopping. Through the water. And then I got him a little puppy cake on Amazon. I swear to God, guys, I'm not I'm not being sarcastic. I reckon she's tried this cake. I reckon when she opened it, she would have said to herself, let me try and see if it's um, human friendly. I reckon she would have tried a bit of that. Who agrees with me? Done. It had good reviews and it's really cute. And it even came with a candle. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my gosh. Like you put the little candle. Why would you fucking put a candle? Do you actually expect Bruno to blow it out? Why would you put a candle near a dog's head? You're so stupid. Candle in the middle here and it's like pre, pre-cut. He can have like one or two slices based on his size. We're gonna sing to him tonight. And, and then you'll have the rest. And to give him his birthday cake. For his birthday, he needs to do his favorite thing, which is swimming in the ocean and running around. So yeah, I'm super excited. My mom is on her way. I'm not gonna put on makeup today. I'm just not feeling it, but I'm so excited. I don't oh. think I've taken him since oh i took him in december with lily but it was a little chilly he didn't go in the water she's already had something to eat because you can see she's cleaning her lips and sorry not cleaning her lips she's cleaning the top of her gums with her mouth or that much but he'll definitely go I'm in today i know my dog something. i also need to show you guys the cutest jacket that i found oh look how cute oh this cool my god oh my god and with those ugly pants Guys, I really think she has an issue, as in a delusion issue. She can't... F I was going to say that looks like a quilt cover for a bed, but I can't even comment that because I don't think I've ever seen a quilt cover that ugly. It is fucking ugly. Do you know what it reminds me of? The, the actual quilt covers, you know when you go to a cheap and nasty... Well, we've been travelling, husband and I, from since we've been married. So I reckon 18 years ago on our honeymoon when we were traveling would see these ugly quilt covers you know there's just cheap and nasty ones and you think oh god this makes me sick it's it's like a real cheap and nasty hotel they just hadn't updated with the times and as times have gotten forth and now they just do white thank god but remember those ugly tacky ugh, thick just um disgusting shaped um bed covers that's what that reminds me of I know it hasn't got any shape on it, but the material and the look of it <laughs> just reminds me of those bed covers, those cheap and nasty bed covers back in the day of the hotel room. The jacket is, it's from Amazon and it's like a free people because I've been seeing these like quilted, almost kind of oh like a bomber. God, quilted. Yes, it's quilted. It reminds me of a quilt cover. Jacket. And this is so nice, you guys. I'm kind of shook. What does she mean free people? She's kind of shook. This fucking bitch here in front of us is kind of shook 
about that jacket that I wouldn't wear if I had if I was homeless. It was so fucking ugly. Look, they have different colors. This is the khaki. It's kind of like a soft pinky khaki. It's not a soft pinky. It's fucking ugly. It's an ugly nude bland color, just like a personality. Nude, but it's quilted. I love the length of the sleeves. Oh like they're not too long. God. And then a little stretch back here. Oh my God. She just looks like a fucking rectangle. They have different colors. It's the perfect spring jacket. I honestly might grab- At this stage, this, this sofa here has more shape than what she does. Grab another color. I love it so much. I feel like it sits like perfectly at the height She's of- She's going to grab another color. She loves it so much and it sits perfectly. It sits, sits perfectly to make her look lo more like Spongebob. Pants too. These are my Halara pants. Right and there. it's like so comfy. See how it's like got the quilting on it? It's thick too and very soft. Like I was kind of shocked. Why do you want it if it's thick? You get hot anyway. So why would you want that? Shocked at the quality of it when I took it out. It's so luxurious and thick and soft. And oh no, you are fucking delusional. You are fucking delusional if you think something like that is luxurious. Just like perfect. So I got the XL. Not, not only delusional, you're ignorant. XL. And I feel like it's uh, the perfect fit. Like I said, they have a bunch of colors. The Free People one of this is $198. And this one, it's originally $65, but I got it on sale for $46. Do you believe the price of these guys? Do you believe the price of these? How maybe that maybe the quality is good. I cannot get over how fucking ugly. Look how it's going up on her hunch back here. Look at it. It is just horrendous. So I'll link it. Hopefully it's still on sale when this goes up. I need to order another color before oh the sale's over. God. I like this is gonna be my go-to spring jacket. Oh I just I don't know. God. I think I'd rather see the Sherpa. Something about it, it just feels like so darn cute. Let's see what other color. So fucking desperate for for that any bit of Oh, the consumerism that makes her happy just makes me ill. She just is so consumed in the consumerism. It is fucking ridiculous. Beyond control. I know YouTubers buy stuff, but she just goes way over the top. Colors they have. So they've got like green, blue. I'm more of like a neutral person. No shit. So. More of a neutral person. No fucking shit, Sherlock. Kind of like the gray Ooh, or the apricot. That's oh cute. But like maybe God. I should just like go bold, you know? Mm, okay, we'll think about it. Okay, my mom's almost. Oh my God, she just makes me ill. She really makes me ill. She's getting worse as she gets older. Almost here, so let's go. We're here. You want to go into Wawa? She's turned into a you want to go into Wawa? And I had thrown her in the Wawa. You want to go in the Wawa? Her poop bag away. She pooped again. I had to take a tissue. She was already talking and her, she was, Nancy was already talking and Alexandra was talking over her as usual. <gasps> oh no. Like, pick it up and carry She's it a double like pooper that. now? Yep. That's rough. She's a double pooper now. Oh my God, her fucking obsession with poop. Chachi girl. Yay, beach day. Let them off their fucking things. My God, he's always got this on the poor dog. If at the beach he cannot have this off, when can he have it off? Come on. Wawa. <laughs> what do you think? It's not like he's going to run in the ocean and not come back. Fucking take it off him. What do you think? What you do you go think? Water? What do you think, baby? <laughs> there they go. Cha Cha does not leave Bruno, so that's why she's not attached. She does not leave her favorite cousin. <laughs> Bruno wouldn't go anywhere with... Uh, oh, maybe he would. Maybe she doesn't have him... Then again, maybe she doesn't have him disciplined. When he's off there, maybe he might just run, run away. Whereas Sinatra doesn't leave my side. He's my shadow. Happy birthday, Juan! Oh, fuck off. Oh, oh look it. He's going. Oh! <laughs> look at him. <her. laughs> the little walk. What do you think, Dave Juan? I think he thinks what it's cold. What do you think? Are you going to gallivant? Come on! Yay! <laughs> Throw for Chow. Chow Chow like sticks. Yay! <laughs> oh, she's so oh, cute. Oh, in the... Oh, yeah! Lino. No? Lino! Lino! <laughs> <laughs> oh, seriously, Neither. Nancy, could you get a bigger stick for him? Oh, he didn't look! 
Mom's gonna throw this massive stick. <laughs> Bruno, focus. Stay with me here. Focus. They're too busy playing. I love when he gets wet and his legs are all skinny. <laughs> yes. You having fun, day one? No stick legs. You got the sheepies. Hi, cutie. I didn't get it on film, but Cha Cha what just went in. Oh. <laughs> it's gonna be full of sand. Look at that. <laughs> Gee, she's a cute dog. <laughs> she's so oh, funny. <laughs> she's polluted right down. There's no one there, Tatch. Tatch is barking at the piece of wood. <laughs> <laughs> Bruno's like, what? <laughs> what are we barking at? <laughs> okay, you guys, the time has come. Do you want your birthday cake? Should we sing you happy birthday? She fucking likes it. Ready to make a wish? The You're two years old. It. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. She's gonna blow it out. Hey, dear Buana. Oh, fuck off. Does she realize how fucking dumb she is when she calls him Buana? Happy birthday to you. Make your wish. It's pre-cut. <gasps> God, that was so close to his face. She's an absolute fucking moron. An absolute moron. You just have to break it. <gasps> Ooh, wow. What do you think? It's made of fruit and stuff. <laughs> I like it. What the fuck? She's covered Bruno's collar, probably because it has, um, I don't know if it would have his address. It most likely would have her phone number on the back of it. As if we can fucking see the phone number on the little tag. It's a success. Bruno's second birthday, he had a good day. He took a nap the whole afternoon after playing in the ocean. Gee, sounds like you. <sighs> Yummy. It's like kind of soft. I was expecting it to be like hard. This is from Amazon. I'll link it if you guys got a dog birthday coming up. <laughs> oh, he likes it. This, my friends, this, her nose is being eaten up by her cheeks. This is after Gary bariatrics fucking surgery. Bariatric surgery. For his size, he can have one to two slices. <laughs> so we'll eat this over the next few days. But Well, it's amazing how you know how many he should have for his size. Why don't you know how, how much goes in your fucking gullet? You're too busy eating anything and everything. Happy birthday, my love. And then blaming the gastric um, bypass for not working. Tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day, and I'm just getting up, just getting my day going. I think I still look half asleep, but that's fine. So I'm really excited because the artwork that I got to put in the book um, case. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. She keeps calling it artwork. It came in from Amazon last night. <laughs> it's from Amazon. It's not only multiply. Oh my god. How produced is this item? And she calls it fucking artwork. So I want to look at it. Also stay tuned because I have an Amazon like dress haul coming. I got like some summery dresses for when my mom and I go to Florida. So stand by. Maybe that'll be in like the next vlog or so. Okay, like this is the perfect size, I think. And it, was it looks too big for where she wanted to put it. For where she wanted to put it, it looked too big. This was $8. Like amazing. Mm. It's got to be some piece of artwork for eight dollars. Framed. It's like perfect. Um, oh my god! Shut the front door. This is perfect. It even has like sheen, so it looks like it was painted. Oh my god! More dead sticks. More dead fucking sticks. But it's a print, of course. <gasps> no shit, Sherlock. Eight dollars, and you want us to th think that that was painted? We're smarter than you. Okay, Amazon. Okay, wait a minute. This is so perfect. I think this is gonna look really good no. there. And like it has like a lot of that brownie tone that, that I got like in the vase and in the dried florals. So yeah, I just got this cute. <laughs> she's saying that this goes with the rest of the aesthetic that she's bought. Cause everything else looks dead that you've got in there. All the colors are dead in there. Of course it's gonna match the dead um, grass. Little like meadow with a little house um they had a few other options that would have been perfect so i'll link this if you guys need 
like a cute little small piece of art. I think they had other sizes, but like such a good price for like a small piece of art you may need. And then I did also grab more command strips. We're a command strip household. I know I removed these wrong <laughs> in the uh, study the other day. If they're kind of like wobbly, like you can kind of tell they're like coming off, I'll just kind of peel them off. I know you're supposed to pull it down. Even sometimes though, when I do the pull down, it'll come off wrong. I honestly just feel like it's a gamble. <laughs> okay, let's go see. No, it's because you're stupid. See how this will look. I also got a package from Milk and all I, all I need to know is if it has the jelly blushes in here, the jelly tints. Why? Why? You you cover up the jelly tints anyway because you're so fucking stupid. You always end up putting the the jelly tints on your face and you blend that in and then you go and fucking put another um, powdered uh, thing on it. Powdered blush. So why the fuck do you want the jelly tints? Because you're so stupid you always cover them anyway. Because if I have to see that one more time, I like will need to go buy it if it's oh, not in here because they look phenomenal. Okay, before I go check the art and see how it will look, I have to open this. It's very heavy, so I don't know. I don't know if it's gonna have the jelly tint. Have you guys seen those? They look like push pops, but they're like a stain. Nope, <laughs> it's not, that's fine. That's Good, because you don't deserve it anyway. It's fine. I am grateful for any PR. I'm gonna have to order one because I just like really need to see it. This is the high grade Kush lip oils. Hemp seed oil, coconut oil, sunflower. Oh great, more fucking oil for her mouth. Great. Oil is pretty glosses. And then and then the Kush mascara in here before I commit to putting it. You're not talking to Bruno, so why are you talking like that? You're not talking to fucking Bruno. Up with my command strips. Oh, that is so stinking cute. Oh, that is big. so cute. I just, I really thought it was gonna be big. Oh my god. Oh my god. Cute. So cute. So, so cute. Oh my god, the whole fucking bookshelf atrocity is just disgusting. Alright, yep. Yep, 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 yep. Let me put it up. A few minutes later. Okay, but how cute. No. I... A fucking picture frame does not go in a bookshelf like that. I've never seen anyone put a picture frame in a fucking bookshelf you moron and these fucking beads you know what they remind me of i don't know if you guys had them i think you did most taxi drivers used to have them back in the day taxi drivers used to have them and a lot of people who sat in their cars they used to have a beaded cut like a, it wasn't a cushion it was just a beaded chair and i think it was meant to be good for your back and your your bum and it was a whole beaded thing you attached it to the cut your car seat back in the day that's what it fucking reminds me of it's disgusting when i say back in the day i'm talking over 40 years ago yeah. sorry yeah over 40 years ago love it i feel like it's so hard to show on camera like i love the vibe of this in person but it doesn't translate on camera but no I think it, it does looks great. it does translate on camera and it looks fucking ridiculous it looks ridiculous you have put so much shit in there so much shit and there are the books i need to incorporate somehow some way oh my god god she's gonna fill it with the books as well well at this stage it is a fucking bookshelf so she take half the shit she's got out of there and put the books in there you can help me right can you help me please he said i'm just a dog run away so on the agenda today gotta go do a grocery pickup um we had a lot we needed so i did a pickup order because i knew i'd get overwhelmed and i'd forget something how about you write a fucking list down? Do you remember those those books that you bought the other day? The papers where you could write stuff down? Why don't you write them down on that? What a fucking waste of money. She doesn't even use them for anything. I don't know if you guys remember. I think she ordered them off... Um, or did she buy them from the... Um, like one of those $2 stores? I don't know. The ones that you just rip off. She can use them. Just write your list down. There's no need to get overwhelmed fucking idiot who gets overwhelmed going grocery shopping i need this moron so we're gonna do a grocery pickup i also really need a manicure it's been about three weeks um and they are look how grown out my thumb is oh my god it looks disgusting. funny um i kind of want to do french it's been a while since i've done french so i might do that um i've also got like fuck can you imagine sitting in front of her with no makeup someone 
spoke to me like this, all I would be doing is looking at the fucking pimples. Some editing and stuff to do, so um, it's gonna be a pretty chill day. It's like rainy, cloudy, very, uh, very chill energy. We're going makeup free. One oh. eternity. How fucking lucky are those people that get to look at your face like that? Later. All right, just got back from the grocery store. We had a huge pickup today. I was so out of everything, so. No. I think he's doing laundry. I hear the laundry machine, the washing machine. Okay, so let's do a little grocery haul. Ooh, I was so excited. These were on sale. He's on a work call, I gotta. These were on sale, I always check. Of course you were so excited. It's about food, it's either food or clothing that you're excited about. The sale section of um, Whole Foods on Prime, and these are on sale. These are the best pretzels. I don't know why, I just love them. Whole grain sea salts. The ingredients are really simple. They just like, they don't- Just what you need for fluid retention, more salt. It tastes like a normal pretzel to me. They're just like the best. If you can try them, try them. Granola for yogurt bowls. We ran out of barbecue sauce. Oh, seriously. I think you can talk a bit fucking louder than that. What's your house made out of fucking paper? Is it paper thin walls? Did you have to whisper like that while he's on a fucking call? I am gonna make uh, some turkey chili one night, so I got crushed tomatoes. One night I'm gonna do like chicken, veggie, and some creamy Parmesan risotto. Oh. Just needed a restock of rice. Really? Oh. I thought you don't have carbs. A lot of oranges. Oh, got yar some juice. Cornbread yeah. to go with- I'm sure it's for yamen. Chili. Some vanilla Greek yogurt for yogurt bowls. Ooh, I'm so happy. I kid you not, I have been going through these like crazy. The Driscoll's Sweetest Batch Blueberries. <sighs> she has no fucking clue how much sugar that stuff has in it. I should just eating it like water. Best. So if you see. Not that you eat water, but you know what I mean. The Sweetest Batch version. I usually love like a jumbo blueberry when they of have course them. You like do. I just feel like they're better. But see how it says sweetest batch? Of course you do. You love anything jumbo going in your mouth. If you see that. That wasn't meant to sound crude, guys. I meant she likes anything. You know what I mean. I think I just better stop it right there. Get it. These are literally so delicious like candy. I will put yep. those on a yogurt bowl. That's why she likes them. Because they're like candy. They're as sweet as candy. Oh, but I have just been eating them plain. Got his bagels. Yeah, sure. We are getting... You fucking eat those bagels. We've seen you eat the bagels. You know how many times? How many fucking times have we seen you eat those bagels? Stop calling them Yars bagels. We know you eat them, Alexandra. Look at the fucking size of you. You think we know you don't? You think we think you don't eat bread? Getting low on chili powder, so I need this for making chili. We are out of shredded cheese. One of my favorite snacks are. She must go through those cheese like there's no one's business. My God. String cheese, yeah. unsweetened vanilla almond milk, turkey pepperoni. I accidentally ordered, okay, good. I ordered two different kinds of unsweetened vanilla almond milk, but this is good till mid-April. So we go through this like a lot with smoothies. Ooh, I got these on sale, I think. Potato cheddar jalapeno pierogies. It just sounded good. Uh, ground turkey for the chili, cream cheese for his bagels. I got some garlic and herb for his bagels. You fucking eat them too. Stop saying for his bagels. You eat them, you stupid cow. We've seen you eat them. You put the avocado on them. And you sprinkle your stupid chia seeds on But marinated chicken breast. We like these less sugar Greek yogurts from Chobani. Onion for the chili. Bananas. We both eat like a banana a day. Some shaved Brussels sprouts. I love just sauteing this. And anything banana shape going in your mouth. And putting a little balsamic vinaigrette or... um balsamic glaze on it and i've been loving cherries that's it time to put all this away many hours later all right yeah, the stuff she didn't want us to see got put in the pantry already you guys it is almost five o'clock i went and got my nails done oh. i didn't vlog the salon was really busy but like is that not the most perfect french you've ever seen she did such a great job yay okay so i'm gonna make something new for dinner but not new <laughs> because i saw this online and I, I saw just bought one onion a way to make chili i make turkey chili i love it we eat it a lot more in the winter but i haven't made it in a while but then i saw this there you go this is, then she saw how can i make this meal more carbohydrated and more um fattening so let me buy some cornbread mix. Casserole where you put the chili at the bottom of a casserole dish and then bake the cornbread on top of it. Mm. So it's like all eating. Yeah, I'm gonna put in 
big scoop of minced garlic, chopped white onion. All that All right. old. We'll let that cook. Fucking heat the pan up before you put your stuff in. You watch cooking shows all the time. She even says it. Heat the fucking pan up, you moron. For a little bit, soften up a little. Then I'll add in the ground turkey. I'm gonna go in now. That's the sizzle you fucking need when you go to put your stuff in. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Okay. Alright. Put the meat masher. Okay, so our turkey's all cooked. Now I'm gonna go in with a 28 ounce can of crushed tomato, some rinsed drained beans. I did a bean blend because that's what I had. I'm gonna add about two cups of water. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start with half a teaspoon of salt, about a quarter teaspoon of pepper, and I might add, I'll probably add more later once I can really give it a taste, but now I'm gonna go in with my other seasonings as well. Do two tablespoons of chili I powder. I don't know why that turkey meat just turns me off. About half a teaspoon of paprika, a little bit of cumin, some oregano. I'm gonna give this a mix and let it simmer for a bit, then I'll taste it and see what we need to add. Okay, I've been letting it simmer for a bit. I ended up adding a little more seasoning to it and it is perfect. Fucking how much seasoning did you add to it? So, we're gonna dump it. The way she talks about food, we're gonna dump it. We're gonna dump it. God, she's ignorant. Gently! Oh my god, it's impossible to do that gently. Oh my gosh. It's splattering. I know that- You're so fucking stupid. Use a ladle, you moron. Use a ladle and put it in your pot- put it in here. There's a better way to do this. Yeah, with a ladle, but you want to do it quickly. I'm just going to go quick. <laughs> quick was actually the correct answer. And I went ahead and mixed up the cornbread mix. Try to evenly... <laughs> this feels really wrong. This feels very wrong. But it had good reviews. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. <laughs> well... <laughs> We'll see. See if this is a big mistake. Into the oven on 350. She laughs like a real fucking idiot. For 35 minutes. All right, you guys, here it is. <laughs> Honestly, it's fully cooked. It's there. It's happening. <laughs> we'll let you guys know if it's better all in one like this or separate. Do you want to tell them how you told me this is a white person recipe? <laughs> I'm just saying. Can you just say it? Like the entire name of this. He kept dish. so I, he's like, "What's for dinner, babe?" And I'm like, "Turkey chili cornbread casserole." <laughs> and he literally <laughs> just goes, "Say it again." <laughs> he's like, "That is the whitest thing I've ever heard." I'm just saying. <sighs> but here's the Yarmouth taste test. How could it be bad? It's gonna be so hot. I'm sorry. It's pretty hot. Oh wow. Is it good? Yeah. I seasoned the crap out of it. No, it's freaking delicious. I added sasson and adobo to it. That's probably why. I know, that's why it's better. I'm not gonna cast through all leftovers because we have way too much. So we're bringing it. Big sleigh. Tomorrow. Bruni and I are bringing my mom some of the chili cornbread casserole. That looks like you're giving her all the cornbread casserole. Doesn't look like Yalman loved it that bloody much. We're all leftovers. How much? We have way too much. So we're bringing it to her on her lunch break. <laughs> he already knows. You know the door. You know the door. Who's excited? Who's excited? You want to see Grandma and Chach? Yay! Chacha! <laughs> Who's the best boy? I'm so happy. Oh, my God. That Chacha is so fucking adorable. You guys, I'm back from my mom's. So last night I ended up taking a shower like right before bed um, oh, with wet fucking nose at hair <laughs> so this is what we're working with i kind of want to see if i could like do the like wavy hair method that i see online <laughs> but i don't know part of me wonders if i have another fucking tiktok trend a little wave that i'm unaware of but i mean if i just like have it brushed and i let it air dry it's usually more like straight like this so i don't know i forgot to put deodorant on this is my newest 
How the fuck do you forget to put deodorant on? Deodorant. It's from the brand Wild, and I really, really like this. It's a really good aluminum-free option. Don't you hate when you have, like, a sweatshirt on or something with the fuzzies, and then it gets on your deodorant? But I had never heard... No, because I usually put it on before I put my clothes on. ...this brand, and I really like it. This is, like, the reusable, like, refillable container. So I figured I would go ahead and like set up my hair because I'll probably wear it for at least a few days. So I was thinking about like putting some rollers in. Use my Velcro rollers. Oh my God, not normal rollers, please. Oh God. I blow dry my hair in my office. Um, I I'm not gonna watch this guys. It's gonna look fucking ridiculous like she did. The oh my God. What the fuck? Oh my god, look, look at that. Not to mention that. <laughs> look at that. Oh, wow. Wow, what a look. Jesus. Fuck. I think, yeah, they're like super cool. I don't know if I need to leave them in longer, but I don't think we do. So let's take them out. Um, this is probably gonna be the end of the vlog because <laughs> hot start the rest of my mom with, but that's going to be a Velcro roll. Okay, these are the funnest ones to remove. It like, and our last one here, and we're gonna flip it back <laughs> and give it a fluffy zhuzh. <gasps> No, I still don't like it. It just, it's just horrible. <laughs> I still don't, I don't like rollers in here like that. Um, you know, it might look nicer on someone else. I think it's, the, I think it's her face that I don't like. <laughs> no shit though. I think it's her face I don't like. Um, it just makes her, fa her face look too wide. Why do? Why do? This is my dream. No. Oh God, no. No. Teams are made of. Ugh, honestly, I love this. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> you love anything. I am absolutely in love. Oh my god, it looks horrible. With this volume. I love it the most with like a swoopy, flippy side part. But if you want to see how it looks with the middle part, it's a great way to get that like bang lift and swoop. Oh. So here's how. Just hate it. How it looks with it in the. I hate that length on her. Middle. <laughs> Nothing sweetening the deal. I definitely it cool heated styling brush. I'm gonna end this vlog here. I actually have to go edit this because it is Wednesday afternoon and this goes up in the morning. I know we all love the morning vlogs, but thank you guys for hanging out with me. And I love you. This vlog. I love you guys so much. And oh, you fucking fake bitch. You better stop saying that. <laughs> it's just so fucking fake. All right, guys. Oh. That's it for now. <laughs> um, all right, so I'm going to end it here. I might do maybe, I've got a little bit of a break in the afternoon. If I have a chance, I've got like an, an hour and a half. I might come back home because I don't live far from home. I don't live far from home. I don't work far from home. Come back and do maybe a little quick live feed. We'll see how we go. Um, it's going to be a busy day for me today. So... Um, I try to, oh, what's that word? I tried to spread out the clients, but a lot of them couldn't come in the times that I wanted them to. So um, just wish me luck with my arms and um, hopefully everything will be all right. But, you know, oh, well, if I get tired, if they get swollen, they get swollen. Not too much I can do. I have to start getting back into work, it's, you know, not, and not spreading them out at one stage, so may as well be now. All right, my my friends, it's lovely to do this vlog for you guys. Had fun with it. Hope I gave you guys a bit of a laugh. Hope you are having a lovely afternoon or evening, and I'll see you in. I might see you later on in the um in the live. If not, I'll see you in the next um the next one that I do. I might do another one later on tonight. I might have a rest when I get home and then I might do another one for you guys. I know you like two coming out in the same day. So I don't want to disappoint. All right, my loves. I'll let you go and I'll chat to you guys later. Bye for now.